technical difficulties. Okay, so we are live, friends. Um, hot mess Carrie with her hot mess hair is here. Today is, and the dogs are out. Can you just put them outside but you keep barking? Gotta love my dogs. Sorry. Okay, so hot mess Carrie's here. We have a non busy day. No, we have a busy day. Um, kind of like a chill day where we are going to, I gotta work out, which is why I look like a hot mess. And then I wanna do some Christmas shopping and I have tons of Christmas wrapping to do and probably some Christmas movies in my future. So instead of picking up pizza or going to the drive-thru, look at this hair, that is crazy. We are going to have dinner in the crock pot. So then at the end of a long day, when I wanna be lazy, dinner will already be done. So let me know what is for dinner tonight. And I'm going to show you how I'm going to turn a lazy day meal into a complete dinner in just a matter of minutes. So let's see, Yvonne is here, Sarah is here, Kim is here, Debbie is here, Kimberly, Billy, Kendall, Sue. Good morning, Barbara. I know you're shocked to see me here in the morning on a Saturday. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Okay, Jenny is here, Cherie is here, woo woo, okay, Jennifer, Anne-Marie, Debbie, Dolores is here, woo hoo. Okay, so let me show you how we're going to make dinner. So today I am using a Lazy Day Cooking Club recipe and I'm going to throw it in the crock pot and it's only going to take me just a couple of minutes. It's super easy. Give me a heart if you want to be able to make dinner in a couple minutes. Okay, so first things first, I got to get the freezer bag out of the bag. Now it is completely frozen, as you can see, solid. The problem is, is that your meal will stick to the bag. So all you do is run it under some water. I used to say warm water, but really any kind of water, just real quick. See how quick this is. Okay, and then in just a couple, like what, a couple seconds? See, look. See how it's now loosened from the bag. So it's not sticking to the bag anymore, okay? Then we're going to take this and we're going to cut it out of the bag. So I just take some scissors, a quick slice, and I'm going to dump it in. Done. For those of you wanting to know, I'm actually making balsamic beef stew. So on our freezer day, we threw everything in the bags, and so that's all I have to do. Now in my instructions, it says to add some tiny potatoes. These are already washed and ready to go. I'm going to do about a half a bag of these. Okay. Spread these around. Then it says a cup of beef broth. However, I'm gonna do two because I like my stew a little soupier than most people probably. Maybe one and a half. That's it. You put this, the lid on, and then you um, cook it on low, or you can cook it on high according to the directions. And that's how easy it is to get dinner done in two minutes. Literally, I've only been live for four minutes. So two minutes it took to throw dinner in the crock pot. So if you have two minutes to get dinner done, would you make dinner? If you had, let me say it again. If you had two minutes, if it only took you two minutes, sorry, replace. If it only took you two minutes to get dinner in the crock pot, would you eat at home instead of going out to eat tonight? If that's you, then the Lazy Day Cooking Club is for you. So let's see who else is on here. Um, Carla is a Lazy Day Cooking Club member and loves the recipes. Woo -hoo -hoo. Rebecca said the planning is my downfall. Rebecca, are you in the club? Um, if you're not in the club, you need to join the club because the great thing about the club is we do all the planning for you. You don't have to do anything. And I don't know if you're like me, but I like to eat based on feelings. So if I'm feeling something healthy, we're gonna eat something healthy. If I'm feeling comfort food, we're gonna eat comfort food. And so the great thing about the club is you prep multiple meals 
and you put them in the freezer. So then you pull out whatever you're feeling. And because you purchase everything on your shopping list, you know you already have everything you need to make that a complete meal. So it's kind of a win-win. You're planning and you didn't even know it. And we have people in the club who are actually, they're not even planning, their kids are doing it for them. So they're getting everything ready and throwing it in the freezer and then their kids are going out to the freezer and picking what dinner, what they want for dinner, which means the picky eaters are now eating. Win-win, right? Okay, let's see. Hello, Carol. Now, if you, how do you join the club? That's a great question. The link is right above this video. If you're on Instagram, I'm gonna add it to my stories. But it's right above the video. You just click the link, you click the get started button, and you join. I highly recommend you join the 20 recipe meal plan. You could totally start out with a 10 recipe, but you're getting way more for the 20 recipe. How much is it? Only $14.99. Super simple. Um, you could do the $9.99, but again, you get so much more for the $14.99. You'll see when you're in the club. But the best, okay, Ashley said, what about terribly picky eaters? Ashley, okay. I have tons of picky eaters in my house. And a lot of people in the club have tons of picky eaters, terrible picky eaters. And the picky eaters are going away. The reason they are is because since they're helping you make the food, they're actually going to try it. Number two, all of our recipes are kid approved. So some of them might stretch their palate a little bit, but if you have severely picky eaters in the private Facebook group, we'll give you tips and tricks on what you can do. So for example, if your kids don't like bell peppers, the problem is, is they don't not like bell peppers. They don't like the texture of bell peppers. So I tell my members to use a food chopper to chop them up into little tiny pieces. So it might become like disappears in your crock pot, but they get the flavor of the bell peppers without the texture of the bell peppers. And so you're slowly teaching them, this has bell peppers in it. And so you actually do like the flavor of bell peppers because the flavor of all the food is actually really good. It's just, they can't get over in their mind. So we're gonna help you in the club with that. Annette has been in the club for months and yet to start. Oh, Annette, you gotta start today. This weekend is the day today. Paula said, so worth it. Brandy said, is there a discount if you pay for the whole year? Yes, there is. Just go to the lazydaycookingclub.com, click on the get started button, and you'll see that you can pick monthly or yearly, and you do get a discount for the yearly. Okay. Carla is in the club, and she said, my husband is super picky and has loved everything I've made in the club. Woo, woo, woo. Cherie said her biggest tip is just pick, and Cherie is a, um, oh my gosh, dog. Cherie has been in the club for a long time, and she said, you just start with a couple meals, and once you see how easy it is, so I always tell people to start with two or three meals. Two or three, give me 10 minutes, and we're gonna change your life. And if you wanna make it super easy, start with the chicken recipes. Just pick two chicken recipes and throw them in the bags, and you're gonna see how life-changing this is, and you're gonna be motivated to do it more. We have another person that said, I chopped my celery and onions up in my dressing and my husband doesn't even know it's there. Exactly. Woo woo, Cherie, you're awesome. Okay, Ro Rosanna says, I worry because it's just my 12 year old daughter and I. Rosanna, the great thing about the club is when you log in online, you can change the servings. So you could easily change the servings to two. However, because most of our recipes are designed for six. However, we do this great thing in the club that my sister started, and it's called Cook Once, Eat Twice. And so we teach you how to take leftovers from one dinner and turn it into a second meal with hardly any work, and nobody will know they're eating leftovers. So we're not saying throw it in the microwave and reheat it. We're actually changing the recipe into a new dinner, and people don't even know. For example, my sister had leftover chicken stew. She had just a couple potatoes left. She took out the potatoes. She threw it in the skillet, mixed it with some um, pasta, and then topped it with some cheese. Nobody knew they were eating leftovers, and it tasted amazing. So that's just one example. Cynthia, make sure you post a picture when you prep this weekend since you're in the club.
Rosanna said, is that part of the recipes, the second meal? No, it isn't. We go live usually on Wednesday or Thursday in the actual club. And so what happens is, is when you join, you're going to have access to an online dashboard where you can pick your recipes. But then as soon as you join, you want to join the private Facebook group. It's called the Lazy Day Cooking Club members group. It's only for people who are in the club. And my sister and I go live in there regularly. And so what we do is on Wednesdays or Thursdays, we do a cook once, eat twice, where you tell us that, hey, I have these leftovers. What can I make? And we give you tips on how you can turn it into a complete meal. The private group is great. Lots of tips and bonus videos. Yeah. Okay, Kathy said another great tip. Kathy, this is a great tip. If you're only cooking for two people, go ahead and make the recipe as is, but put it in two separate freezer bags so you get two dinners out of the one. That's so easy to do. Um, how do you get notified when you go live? At the top of the Facebook page, you can select I want to see her first and you'll get notified every single time we do anything. And so that's super great. Cherie said the private group becomes a family. Yes, it does. Cherie, you're so sweet. Okay. Okay. I'm making sure I'm not missing anything. How do you join? You just click the link above, hit the get started page and you join. I highly recommend you do the $14.99, but if you're kind of nervous, just start with the $9.99 plan. How do I get to the private Facebook group? Once you join Denise, it's um, the page, the thank you page has a link. Hey, join the Facebook group now. You'll answer the questions and then we'll, it takes us, um, on the weekend it takes us a little longer to approve people because it's family time. But you know, 24 to 48 hours give us time to actually get you joined, okay? I'm gone for 12 hours. Can I use delay on my crock pot? Yes, you can. And a lot of people we say, so let's say you're going to be gone for 12 hours on this one. You can cook it on low, decrease it by an hour, and it'll automatically go to warm when you're done. So your dinner is still nice and toasty when you get home. How was the movie last night? The movie la last night was great. So we went and saw um, Jumanji. We loved it. Tracy says it's well worth the money. Okay, so... It took me two minutes. I've talked enough, guys. We're out of here. I just hope that I inspired you to make something simple in your crock pot today. But I promise you, this dinner is going to be good. I'll try to post a little picture um, when it's done so you guys can see it. So make sure you join our free Facebook group, Eating on a Dime Recipes. And if you haven't yet, join the club. The link above. Um, Jenny says, have you baked your, a cake in your pot yet? I have not. Donna says she hasn't been a member long, but she's loving, um, all the help. I just missed her comment. Ah, uh, and Justin, who is new to the club, he says, thanks to the clubs. I've been increasing my palate with spices. Yes. Yeah, I'm adjusted. I'm making balsamic stew. Well, I already made it. it. Took me two minutes. So, okay, you guys have a super Saturday. <laughs> I hope I inspired you to make something good. Join. Wait, wait. Start over. I hope you guys have a great day. Join the club today. Bye, friends. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.